Thank you. Hi, everyone. Okay, so thanks for being alive, at least those that left uh, and stayed. Uh, I'm Marian, uh, and I'm the CEO of Amodo. Amodo is a provider of a mobility platform for insurance industry. And what we help insurance to achieve is to launch usage-based insurance product on their market. After five years being on the market and launching more than 20 different usage-based insurance products from Brazil to Singapore, there is, there is one thing that we learned in terms of the usage-based insurance industry. And that is to differentiate strongly between successful programs, between not successful ones. The key success factor for the usage-based insurance products is, um, unsurprisingly, customer engagement. But the question is why? Uh, customer engagement is something that in the UBI industry, first of all, engages the customer and enables us to get the data. We need data because that's how we build usage-based insurance products. The second thing, uh, we need customer to be engaged with a system that changes their behavior. If they are not engaged with the system, how can we change the customer behavior? And the third one, uh, the customer needs to be engaged with the system so that we have efficient communication channel through which insurance company can distribute and promote their products. Unfortunately, the traditional insurance products are by design non-engaging. And they are designed not to be engaging because customer engagement means cost. I want to sell this product and I don't want the customer to call me ever again because him calling me means cost. So we are coming from that mindset. Actually, the best performing insurance products are buy and fly products. And now this is radically different to what we need to have in the industry in order to have the usage-based insurance products successful, right? Customer engagement. It's a big barrier that the industry needs to overcome, and we help it. So what I want to show you today is a part of our platform that deals with customer engagement mechanics. On the past conferences at DIA, we have shown how our platform helps insurance companies to build usage-based insurance products based on behavior data, how to distribute them through the sales agent network, assuming they have one. Today, we are on a customer engagement part. Uh, so let me show you some of the live examples that will depict in the best way, so we can switch to the, to the telephone, in the best way, what, what is it that we are talking about when it comes to customer engagement? It's very important to be aware of the fact that the customer engagement needs to be designed. The customer engagement needs to be designed and it needs to be planned for. It's not something that just happens if you have a good design or if you send promotional messages. Doesn't work. That's not the customer engagement, okay? So I want to show you this discount system because this is a typical discount system in the UBI world. This discount system tells the, to the customer the following. If you record 100 kilometers of your driving and have a score 85 to 94, you will get a, a discount of 7%. Well done. If you record between 400 and 750 kilometers and have a score of, let's say, 90, you're going to have a 9% discount. And if you record 750 plus kilometers, with a super trooper score of 95, you're going to get 15% discount. Now, there's one big design flow in such a discount system. And that design flow is actually this small plus next to 750. Because it tells to the customer, I don't care if you're engaged with my system after you record 750 kilometers. It doesn't matter to me. I'm not going to reward you or incentivize you. We just want to make a snapshot, and I'm unwearing, un unaware that I'm actually, as an insurance company, creating a huge opportunity cost here. This is a, a system that is not designed for a long-term engagement. On the other hand, we are working with insurance companies that are very much focusing on building, on designing, on planning the customer engagement. Uh, this is an example of a different discount system that has been planned for customer engagement. Here, the customer, when he signs in, gets a 5% signing bonus. And according to many analysis, this is one of the best practice models. And then every month, depending on a customer engagement, depending on a level of a customer engagement and the safe driving, he can get additional 1% or 2% discount, which means, to sum up, across the whole year, the customer can get up to 30% discount. Now, 30% discount is a lot, but what do we get in exchange for this one? We get a customer to use this system for a whole year long, to be on our communication channel whole year long, to collect the data whole year long. 
right? And most importantly, it's not about changing the short-term behavior. It's about changing the habit that drives the claim and risk uh, down. So this is designed for engagement. I'm going to show you how we uh, treat this in a backend afterwards. So there's another thing that I want to show, which is a component of our engagement system. A model platform supports all standard uh, gamification mechanics, such as badges, achievements, reward points. So from the platform point of view, you can do pretty much everything. The question is how you put it on the market. This is a project in Brazil. It's a live one. And here, the customer is assigned, gets a certain tasks that he can perform. These tasks are assigned on an individual basis. What does it mean? It means that depending on the exposure risk that the customer has, from the, uh, depending on his driving behavior, so for example, if I'm the driver that is exposed to a certain risk because of one particular aspect of my driving, which is over speeding, I'm going to get the task that address exactly that aspect of my driving. On the other hand, if I'm the other customer that is uh, exposed to a high risk because of aspect of driving that is related to distracted driving, I'm going to get the task to perform that address that part of my driving behavior. Of course, it's not only about changing the behavior, it's also about uh, gamifying, it's also about creating a better experience for the customer. So here, the customer can share this task on the social network, he can brag, he can collect reward points. This is another mechanic, an example. Uh, where the customer, by performing a sequential tasks, gets an access to instant rewards. So it's all fun, it's all engaging, and you can create a great stuff with it. But um, what is missing here, um, free coffee is a great stuff. Free coffee, everyone likes free coffee, right? Um, coffee, good, like. Free, good, like. Free coffee, what's not to like? Uh, however, coffee is attainable. Coffee I can reach. If my insurance company doesn't buy it for me, I can buy it for myself. But to create an experience with this same mechanic is something that uh, Triglav in particular uh, brought on a different level. Here, the customer, if he's a good driver, if he performs certain tasks, he gets access to a beast, 500 horsepower beast that he can drive over the weekend. And that's something I'm not going to organize myself. That's not reachable for me. That's not attainable for me. And this creates an amazing emotional response. What does it mean, emotional response? It means that like this, you're converting your customers from liking your product to loving your product, from loving your product to embracing and recommending your product. This is how you build advocacy. So the second very important component is to build this experience, which this uh, example shows very well. Now, if we switch to the backend system, I'm going to run through it. So. Uh, not to go into uh, too much details now, but uh, in general, this is where you can configure everything, and this is where, for example, you can uh, assign achievements to a segment, what I was mentioning before. We have dynamic segments. Depending on a customer behavior, through our AI, they are moving automatically through different segments and different tasks and challenges. And in general, this gamification mechanic is applied on a segment level. What I want you to take away from this demo is the following thing. Customer engagement needs to be designed. It it's, it's not something that just happens by sending a promotional message to the customer. It needs to be designed carefully. We can help you with that. It needs to be implemented in a platform that can optimize it. A model platform does it. And just to close it, uh, Best Review Magazine by AM Trust uh, named Amodo as the best insure tech company on the planet and wider uh, when it comes to customer engagement. So if you are planning to launch usage-based insurance products or have difficulties with the one you have, please talk to us. We are at the booth in front. Thank you so much.